Associative memories might be the time that you hear a particular song or smell a perfume or, or a cologne or something that suddenly takes you back and reminds you of a person, place, or thing. Those same kinds of associative memories go along with drug use. You'll hear, for example, like you hear cocaine addicts talk about um, money, and when suddenly they get a lot of money in their pocket from a paycheck, or sometimes they smell of citrus, or uh, different parts of the city that they may just drive through. Um, I took her to a doctor's appointment to get blood work. The nurse put the needle in her arm to take the blood. When Erin came out, she was a mess. She was crying and, and doubled over with pain, you know, stomach pains. And I didn't understand, but she told me that when the nurse put the needle in her arm, it, it triggered something and made her think about using heroin. And she had been clean for nine months before that. Just the needle made her think about it and it brought back the cravings and she started going almost going through withdrawal that's what it was like we ended up going back to her work and um, she left work and, and went to Philly and that was the last time I saw her and next thing I know I got a phone call saying she was dead so it ended quickly you know I had a person one time who was a heroin addict and, and every time that she shot up she would have a little bit of blood splatter and she would clean the bathroom that she shot up in before she would go into her nod, right? And then later when she would clean bathrooms, she actually would have cravings for drugs because it brought back the memory.